Hello, Sagittarians. Welcome to Visions of Light and Love. This is your reading for the energy in August. This reading will be for all of the Sagittarians out there. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. If you are a returning viewer, welcome back. And if this is your first time stopping by, welcome to Visions of Light and Love. If this reading does not resonate with your situation, feel free to check out your Moon, Venus, and Rising Sign videos. Cross watchers are welcome as well. If you like my energy and you feel like I'm the reader for you, feel free to hit the subscription link if you have not already, along with the notification bell, so that you are notified when new videos are posted. Also hit the thumbs up image to help the video circulate for something more private, more detailed and specific. The links for personal readings will be posted in the description box below the video. All right, so let's see. Some of you have options or someone around you has options and love. Someone is like, <laughs> Ooh. Someone is the center of attention. I know this is not the six of wands, but someone here gets a lot of attention, but I feel like they keep it to themselves. Let me know in the comment section if this is you or your partner. I feel like in the past, someone may have come back for a second chance. This person could have come back in with a proposal However, I see this person had you in their mind or you had them in your mind, but you two were not on the same page. I feel like you may have wanted to devour this person for some reason. They, someone here may have had a child with another person. Let me know in the comment section if someone had a baby or had a child with someone else. Right now. Or someone could have gotten you pregnant. And this person may have stepped out of the relationship. And this is why you're setting this person on fire. <clears throat> if you are the feminine energy. <clears throat> And they, they are coming in, or they did come in for a second chance. But right now, I feel like some of you are just nurturing your children. If you have children, you're focusing on yourself. You're meditating, isolating. Some of you need a vacation. Some of you need to take a trip on the other side of the world. Some of you may be thinking about typing a book or writing a book. Some of you are just telling this person, no, like, no, I don't have anything else for you. That's what I'm saying. Some of you are telling them, no, I don't have anything else for you. I gave you all I got. I don't have anything else to give you. Not at this point in time in my life is what I'm hearing. In the near future, I see two of cups, give and take, reciprocity, Seeing eye to eye. I feel like that's this person trying to come in to have this with you, but you're not paying them any mind. And that's what's going to cause them to feel disappointed, betrayed, and stabbed in a bait. And this, again, could very much be your energy. Feeling betrayed and stabbed in a bait because this person may not be paying you any mind. I see them feeling overwhelmed, overworked, because now they're ready to commit. This person is ready to commit, and they want reconciliation. 
But I don't see you wanting that. Let's see. Yeah, I see you being guarded. See, this is them working hard, trying to work hard, overwhelmed because they want to come in with commitment now. They want reconciliation. They want things to go back to how they were. However, that's not what you want. Some of you want victory in this situation. Some of you are waiting. You're making them wait. You're guarded. Your heart chakra is blocked. And again, you're not paying them any mind. <clears throat> yeah, look at this. Oh, could be dealing with the Pisces. You're not paying this person any mind. With their hangman. This person could be losing money behind this breakup. They're up at night wondering if the situation is really over. They need to take a vacation. Yeah, this person is uncertain. Could be a Cancer or a Pisces. They're wondering, did I lose my person? Wounded. Because they're like, all right, I'm, I'm trying to persevere. I'm trying to overcome this. I want my second chance. Now I see your value. This is what this person is saying. Could be a Scorpio. I see your value now. I see what you bring to the table. I see who you are. Can I have a second chance? And you're like, hmm, hmm, hmm. I'm hearing that song by Joe Scott. I'm making you wait. Yeah, you're being strong. You're taming yourself. Because you know this person gets attention. You know they're good looking. They may be fit, have dark features. Some, this person may have a white car, a gray car, or a red car. But this person is charming. They get a lot of attention. They could be in a limelight. But I feel like they keep it on a low. Somebody keeps something on a low. Yeah, this person is blocked. You two, you, you two are not even like... You're emotionally and physically apart from each other. You're nurturing yourself, taking care of your home. If you have children, you're taking care of the children. You're not thinking about this person. Yeah, you've moved on. You've moved on. You're healing. You are stabilizing your finances, your home. You're not thinking about this person. What you say, Sagittarius has left the building. You've moved on. Some of you moved on from a Cancer or a Taurus. Yep. And now this person wants to come in. They're trying to be serious now. They want to move forward, possibly get married with their hierophant. And again, they're two of cups. Some of you may be meeting a new person. If this is this person coming in, you're going to watch. You're going to continue to make them wait for this new stable beginning. And you're going to wait and watch to see what they do. I feel like a lot of talking is going to take place. There's going to be a lot of talking that take place. Because I feel like your person may be trying to control the outcome of the situation, which will result in you walking away from them and ending the situation altogether. Putting an end to the situation altogether. Yeah, which will result in them wanting to come after you even more and feeling anxious because now this person think 
that you walked away because you gave options. When in all actuality, you're just making them wait. Okay? Some of you are not thinking about another person. You're just making them wait. You want to see, you want to see what this person does. So I'm going to leave it at that, Sag Sagittarians. This is your reading for the energy in August. This reading is for the Sagittarian Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Comment below. Let me know if this is your story. Share, like, subscribe. Hit the notification bell. Be safe. I am sending you love, light, peace, and healing energy. Thank you for watching. Enjoy the rest of your week, and I will see you next time. Bye.